University. I'm the director of the international office. So uh, my colleague uh, Zhang Chen and I are very glad to be invited to attend this meeting. So firstly, I would like to thank the Kyoto University because uh, you know, maybe finally I forgot to say this sentence. So I will introduce my university and uh, make a presentation. My colleague uh, will answer your question. I think that this is fair to us. So before the presentation, I would like to uh, brief our university to you. So Wuhan University is located uh, uh, here. It's uh, really middle of China. So many people will maybe don't know this city, but actually it's a very big city. So these two pictures, one, yeah, yeah, this one is my university administrative building. This is one, it's very special. It's a very connected with the Japan. So this is a flower, everybody knows. Yeah, yeah but uh, why we got so many of these kind of flowers? I don't want to say here. <laughs> so, Wuhan University is founded uh, actually in the end of the Qing Dynasty. It's one of the best universities in Chinese mainland. We got the most beautiful campus in China. We have uh, yeah, about uh, 50,000 students. The campus is very big. Over 2,000 degree or long degree students from more than 100 and regions. So we got a lot of uh, people from Africa because they got their support from the Chinese government. So each year, more than 600 domestic students study abroad during their study at the Wuhan University. And over 700 graduate aides go abroad for further study. They don't want to work in China. So the director goes to the American and European, including Japan, South Korea. So now uh, I will tell you something about the current situation about the, the student exchange or student internationalization. Now we are doing something, but it's not very effective. Yeah, first, uh, we make use of uh, a state uh, a sponsored uh, overseas study programs. So we got uh, some money from the Chinese government, yeah, because our university is directly belongs to the Chinese Ministry of Education. And second, uh, we encourage the students self-supported all this study. The yeah, three so exchange programs with the foreign institutions. So that includes some student, some institutions from the South Korea and the Japan and the Singapore and the China Taiwan. The next uh, we international joint education programs. So now we joined uh, with now we have some joint classes with the foreign universities. The international summer courses and the overseas internship on summer vacation or winter vacation. By the Wuhan winter is very cold. <laughs> and so on. It's about uh, light exchange programs. Uh, 26 international joint education programs. So it's operated now in our university. 
These programs provide over 1,000 students with the opportunity to study abroad per year. In the past year, Wuhan University has actively promoted promoting the internationalization of students and has made recognized achievements. Also, that's enough for example. Also, most partner institutions of Wuhan University is in Europe. This is uh, this seems yeah this uh, uh, maybe something that connect the, the, the history of Wuhan University. According by, according to the comprehensive report in PhD degree granted by U.S. University during 1999 to 2003, 340 undergraduates from the Wuhan University obtained their PhD degrees from the U.S. universities. This number is ranking top eight among Chinese management universities. So we are. So the same. We still face uh, many problems. So now I only uh, tell some uh, major problems. Uh, first, uh, lack of uh, motivation for the internationalization of students. The uh, college, schools, and the departments are not active. Maybe you ask me why, so I will tell you. The programs for internationalization of the students cannot produce appearance benefits for colleges, schools, and the departments. This is a real Chinese situation. And they even demand the colleges, schools, departments to spend more money. And second, the teachers are not as they are supported. The teachers want to engage those excellent students in their own research group. They don't set them go broke. The three the students themselves are not passionate. This is because the students are concerned that they may miss opportunities in domestic job market. So I think everybody knows in China, the development of the economy is very quick, but it's not very stable. <laughs> Another two reasons. Higher costs of study abroad, less of international vision. So I don't know how to yeah, brought or raise the students international vision. Not enough uh, education capacity for internationalization of study of students. The fact of lack, lack of international consciousness, ability to conduct international exchange and the necessary language skills. So as we know the most teachers in Chinese universities, they are forced by ourselves. So they have no chance to study abroad for a long time. And second, there is a shortage of foreign teachers, especially those with higher quality. Not enough in English in taught courses, especially the courses of understanding the world and the courses uh, introduction or, or introduce introduce Chinese culture will be like some people said uh, uh, yesterday is cross uh, cultural courses limited resources for students to study abroad and exchange. Money is money. We said uh, money is not everything, but uh, without money, everything is nothing. <laughs> Inefficient management of international affairs. So this is my mistake. So many dudes above mentioned the problems 
A lot of students are participating in the program is still very small, very low. And the rate is less than 3 percent yeah, of the total student population. So we have no so many programs. But uh, why? What's the reason? So now I give some of my main courses. The financial courses. So just now I say the money is really very, very important. In educated financial import by state and the local government. Maybe yeah, my Chinese colleagues know that the Hubei province and the Wuhan city is uh, still not very developed. Developed. Develop. So the local government generally they will not invest money to our university. So the university is not able to supply enough money to implement more programs, especially high level ones. The most students' family cannot afford costs of the yes, internationalization programs. Maybe some students they can afford, but they don't want yeah, uh, to I don't want to pay so much money. The financial programs are, are the most important fact in preventing excellent students from <coughs> taking part in internationalization programs. The environment and the policy. The location of Wuhan University, center of China, yeah, which sees relative underdeveloped economy and unfavorable weather condition. So I will remind all the friends, if you want to visit Wuhan, you should choose the right reason, uh, right season. International ideas are absent in making management policies. This is the main problem. So the colleges, schools and departments are a lot active in this job, yeah. in this work. The teachers are not active in offering English taught course because they will not get more benefits. The above mentioned the three problems, problem. yeah. among other things, make the university less competitive in attracting quality education resources, such as high quality foreign teachers and exchange student. So how to save, uh, oh, no, 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 I still some problem. Yeah? That's a strategic plan and the mechanism. The Wuhan University lacks of a clear strategic plan. Efficient measures of implementation and of evaluation. Many, many divisions and the faculty is weekly coordinate in, promote, in promoting the internationalization. With regard to the above mentioned programs, the Wuhan University is making a strategic plan, making full of use of the domestic and the international resources to efficiently promote internationalization of students. Because now we got a lot of, I got some money, not a lot of money. I got some money from the government. Okay. So the first uh, yeah, intensifying the capacity of international education of the students. Because the guy is reminding me. <laughs> so making the most quality internet yeah, quality international education resources. So the first one, uh, yeah, clear ob objective and the efficient measures of international action of the students will be defined in the strategic plan to ensure the effic efficient implementation of the strategic and the measures. The university has set up an initiative for the evaluation and the cooperation 
by reforming and perfecting institutions and the mechanism of international exchange cooperation, intensify and improve the coordination between management division and the faculties. That's a very difficult work. By improving facilities and making favorable policies yeah, to attract more foreign teachers and uh, retain talents from overseas, to improve teachers' ability to engage in internationalization. But learning advanced education ideas and experience introduce advanced uh, curriculum system. It's very important. And, and the teaching materials and the adopting them into the Wuhan University's education system. So offering a better of internationalization uh, on uh, some program, pro programs, yeah. offering English taught course, offering English taught course is about international understanding and cross culture to internationalizing the curriculum, curriculum and improve the course of teaching content. So this is intensifying the capacity of international education of the students, a clear objective and efficient measure. To show the efficient implementation of a strategy and the measures and uh, improving facilities and making favorable policies to attract more foreign teachers and the retainer. So with making the most uh, popular So I believe we are facing similar problems in the internationalization of the students. How we have to take different measures to address these problems because we are in different atmospheres. Finally, I sincerely wish all of your universities can make great achievements. Thank you for your attention.